I'm um, Brian Oates and uh, I've lived around this way for the last uh, 30 years since I came over from England and um, I guess uh, probably, I don't know, in the blood that uh, you sort of get involved in communities and volunteering and um, so I came here in 82 in April and by the end of the year I was on the local school council and um, I guess I've not sort of looked back since then that people have uh, invited me to take part in things and I found it very uh, rewarding um, and satisfying to be uh, a volunteer and to be involved in our community. I think we've got a, a really great community out here and um, a lot of different people. I found uh, being a migrant myself that um, had a lot in common with uh, people from multicultural backgrounds and um, I wanted to try and help them and promote them so a lot of the things I've been involved in have been uh, around diversity. Um, I thought it was a good idea that everybody should know who the Aboriginal tribes are that used to um, occupy this, this land. And um, I, I think it's now something that's generally known, whereas um, when I came here not only did people not know um, who the local Aborigines were, they, um, you know, they didn't really have that much interest. But uh, now um, people are taking a bit, bit more interest in, uh, in history. Um, in terms of what I'm doing at the moment, I guess I'm just uh, just finishing a stint as chairman of the uh, Southern Health uh, Community Advisory Committee. Um, that's really a, a, a very satisfying uh, committee to be on. You really appreciate it, and uh, um, Southern Health really uh, helps their uh, their community and uh, their volunteers and, and advisors. So um, I've, I've been very pleased with that. Uh, also um, on the committee of the John Panstopoulos Hall where there's a number of multicultural ethnic senior citizens groups that, uh, that meet there and um, we've run that for 15 years now and it's always been very successful. I've been in Parliament now for 20 years and most of that time I've spent working with Brian Oates and as a local councillor, as a community activist. Brian came here as a migrant from the UK. His passion's been migrants, his passion's been workers, his passion's been about working class areas like Dufton and uh, it's great to be here at the Multicultural Centre over here in Dufton uh, where Brian has done so much of his community work, he's currently president of the uh, Migrant and Refugee Centre in the South East, he's helped all sorts of sports clubs, all sorts of community organisations in the area and he's always had a holistic approach, he understands not just about organisations, it's about how people live in their houses, it's about how their streets look. When you drive around Dufton now, when you see the newly rebuilt streets and footpaths and curb and channel, even important things like this make communities feel proud. And Brian made sure that older established suburbs like Dufton had the money put back into them to rejuvenate them, to improve them, to make them improve the quality of life of all the people living there. So good on you, Brian. Thanks for all the work you're doing and we keep encouraging you to do another 20 odd more years of community work. Thanks very much, mate. My name is Chin Li. I'm the treasurer of the John Hunter Supplies Hall and I know Brian for more than 20 years and we have been working together. Uh, he's a nice person, uh, very caring and looking after the seniors of the multicultural groups. Hi, my name is John Collard. I've been living in that area, city of Casey, for about 33 years. Mm -hmm. I've been had the opportunity and the Pleasure to have been associated with Brian Oates for the last 10 years uh, at the Dofton Hall, which is the John Pantapolos Hall. And he's a great man. He has done so much for the multicultural senior citizen in that area, and he's still continuing to do so. He's very caring, understanding, and actually takes care of every single person in need. My name is Jennifer Kong. I'm from the Southeastern Chinese uh, Senior Citizen Group. I'm currently the secretary for the John Pender's Jobless um, Committee of Management and I knew Brian um, more than 20 years and he has been with the multicultural group um, all this while as a president and he has been uh, very committed in his services and he has been helping the non-speaking uh, multicultural groups to liaise with the city of Kaisi and uh, he has been very caring and uh, we love him, he's a great man. I don't encourage anybody else who's got any spare time and um, not particularly uh, wrapped by the television that we uh, we watch every evening or we could watch every evening. Uh, you know, if you're not really interested in that, then um, it's, it is really very rewarding and satisfying to 
um, take a position in some organisation and volunteer and help the community because um, you know, everybody uh, everybody benefits from it and uh, you can really find a lot of uh, joy in doing something like that.